Okay, guys, we are back for our last part of this little update, you know, um, with you for July 16, 2019. And what I wanted to say before was, you know, what I try to accomplish with these updates, of course, show you this thing is nearly done, you know, show you the progress that we've made and the evolution of the game and kind of like get you more acclimated to the game. Um, and the big thing, though, what was really great about this series of updates is to show you all the work we have gotten done, like preparing this final content. I mean, getting those 558 monster cards out of the way and all the loot cards and the hero cards you're about to see. Um, and what, what was the other thing we looked at? You know, the card backings that David finished. That was, that was huge in getting that done. And so, you know, next week at this time, definitely the cards will all be finished because I said I'm working you know, from the most to the least amount of cards and we'll be, you know, on the other few things that need to get done and definitely by in Jan by the end of July this we'll be sending this off to, you know, the manufacturer and this thing is done. Thank the gods of Avalon. So again I hope you like this one. This was kinda long, but you know, it's we're at the end of the game and I wanted to show you some of the final stuff and teach you more about it. Teach you more about the game. Okay, so let's, we're going to be glowing about Dean Spencer is um, an artist that he did a lot of stuff in the game and we worked together and stuff. So we're going to be looking at the final um, card backings for the hero's special abilities. So let me explain that, you know, there's, there's 13 heroes in the game. One is Albus, the, the party's fetch hound, but he doesn't have special abilities. So the 12 heroes that are in the game... All of them start off with, um, they have three unique special, well, they actually have four. They are um, issued counterattack um, at the start of the game. We're going to get to that. So these are just some of the some um, pr old promo posters I pulled up to show you. This is like Mahaliak here in his star, one of his special abilities is um, Frenzied Charge. Here is Lorena Nightweave and one of hers is um, Summon Spectral Sword. And um, they're, they're fun special abilities to use. Really fun. Um, so again, each hero has... Let's just, here, let's bring all these in because it will probably explain this better. Okay, so let's take... See Enwin here. This is our archer. At the start of, of every game, the heroes don't start with like here. Hopefully you can see all this. You know, there's she has dual shot, um, long shot, and pinning shot. So each, since heroes go up to level three, their special abilities can go up to level three. So, you know, there's nine cards. Hopefully that makes sense. You know, there's three special abilities. They go up to level three, nine cards. Um, however, at the start of every game, every hero starts with counterattack. And what counterattack does is starts um, when, when during the monster phase of a turn, that's when the monsters, the guardians and minions of the dungeon will attack the heroes or can attack the heroes. So they have to defend in all three phases because, you know, they're, atta they're being attacked. However, the great thing about counterattack is and it's a very great special ability to start off with. You can attack back in one phase of combat. So that's what that is. And it costs one essence to do so. So um, to give you an example here, just real quick, I had, these are some old, this is some old promo posters I did um, for one of the updates. We're doing the rule book. But here, Banevik here, of course, all monsters are versed in three of the six warfare types. So it's, it's Banevik's turn. He's attacking Mahaliak, our guardian, our, our, our hero, rather, sorry. Banevik is the guardian. So he's attacking our hero, Mahaliak. Well, those are the battle tokens, and it shows it's on the defense side for phases one, two, and three. Well, what, what Mahalia can do is use counterattack. And here, that is here. And notice, here's counterattack. And that will allow Mahalia to attack in one phase of combat instead of defending in it. So we can look down here on the chart. He's defending in phase two, or in phase one and phase three. However, he's going to push the attack because he activated counterattack. So it's quite simple. And so he is going to, that will allow him to attack Bainvik, Bainvik back in phase two of combat. And again, it costs one essence to, there's the card. Oh, it's kind of fuzzy. Sorry. It costs one um, essence to cast that. And essence is down here. Notice um, on the hero cards, there's the 
here's the health track. That's your essence track down here. So you'd have to take one essence away to use counterattack. So that's that's what that is. So we'll close that out. So every hero starts with counterattack. Um, and so these are the the big the thing to take away is though, Dean, you're awesome. I love you. Thank you. He prepared all of these cards for printing, and there was a lot of them. So um, these are all the the heroes, the standard heroes in the game, or what comes with the three editions: um, the cleric, the knight, um, the rogue, wizard, archer, and, bar and barbarian, Mahaliak. And then we have the expansion heroes, and of course those got all done. And we'll just take a look at those real quick. And here, there's a bard hero in the game, Matari. And um, this is a very cool one we'll touch on real quick. This is enchanting him. Let's say, like, your heroes are attacking a guardian, three of them. You know, you can party up to three heroes, and this guardian's warfare values are very high. Well, Matari can activate this anytime during the hero phase. So she can activate enchanting him, and what will, that will do is that'll, that'll boost up all of the hero's warfare values by plus two at level one. And of course, as it goes up to level th two and three, it's a little more essence, but it'll even, you know, it'll raise up those warfare values higher. So this is something very good when you're combating like guardians and you need a little bit extra, have Matari cast enchanting him and you'll do a little bit better with it. So that's a little bit of that. These are all done. There's the battle mage. Um, Lyrena, Paladin, Consecrate, Consecrate Ground, Consecrate Ground, Healing Hands, Holy Guardian, Our Priestess Hero, Awesome with Healing, Healing Light, Heavenly Ark, and then um, Our Ranger and Warlock. So those are all done. So guys, we're going to go back to this. I hope you like this extended update. It gave me a chance to kind of, you know, break away from converting all these files and chat with you and let you know that we're very close to finishing. I mean, getting all of what I just said done, huge, huge plus to getting this thing to manufacturing. And I'm glad all that, definitely those monster cards, 558 monster cards was a lot to get ready. But um, we're definitely almost there. I hope everybody has a really great day, rest of your summer. I'll be back in another week, eight, nine, ten days around there and um, show you even more. And that I hope you really enjoyed this. If you have anything to say, just let me know. Any questions about the game, um, check the links below. I left a lot of stuff for you. Okay, guys, I love hanging out with you, and I will see you soon, and I'll be talking to you soon. Bye-bye.